Today, I hope you decide to walk away from everything that hasn't given you peace. I hope you realize that calm waters won't come until you face them. I hope you look at your decision as a release and not a consequence. When peace is the objective, people lose you, not the other way around. I hope you prayed before you take this decision. Isolation may proceed, so you'll have to be ready for the transformation, and only God can direct you. Welcome to yet another video. Welcome back. How you doing? Komasavo, darling. Today we are doing DIY for my uh, for paintings. DIY paintings for my living room and for my bedroom. <clears throat> I'm pouring in my white cement. I got this from Nakasero, downtown Kampala. This uh, each kilogram was three thousand. I was presently surprised because I thought it would be like 15, 20, 30,000 per kilogram, but I was surprised. So I'm going in with water um, to make a paste, to make a paste and a good consistency. I went in with more water. I don't know whether it was supposed to be thick or medium or runny. I was just, baby, we are just trusting the process. Okay. So I, I keep adding in more water. I keep adding in more water to like uh, make the consistency on how I want. Okay, mix, 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 just like your boyfriend mixes your feelings, darling. Continue mixing. We're, tr we're trusting the process, baby. We are just trusting the process. I, uh, I bought the cement, uh, the white cement at 3,000, then that hand, whatever, that metal thing at 2,000. I got the canvases at 45,000 each. It was a discount because I bought two. I, um, I bought them from the craft village at, uh, the East African market. I think they call it the East African market on Buganda Road from a guy called Rasta. I'm definitely going to be putting up his number. So I'm going in with my, uh, with my pest. I actually like how it, it is already. Like I'm going in with my pest and spreading it all over honestly speaking this is very exhausting i feel exhausted already my back is hurting but baby 
<laughs> we gotta do what we gotta do darling but i love this experience i love um trying new things yeah and i love being creative so this is a good thing for me you can do this as well if you want to spend time with yourself you know a little solo date idea you can have some you can do this with your friend with your best friend have some pizza as you paint yeah but i was doing it by myself so i spread my um spreading my concrete all over uh the canvas and making sure it is exactly where i want it to be using um a newspo from uh from instagram from a creator who also diy'd her living room uh painting so th that is what i am using as a reference to make um my texture and to uh, like to come up with the designs i don't know why the designs were <clears throat> are not coming along I don't know if it's because of um the fact that the paint the concrete is a bit um is a bit light or watery. I don't know what it is, but we are going to freestyle it. Mama didn't raise no loser, darling. So we are flexing and um making this canvas whether i want it or not bestie so yeah
For the second painting, which is going to be the painting for my living room, I'm going in with like a thicker consistency than the first one because I realized the first one, the texture was not coming out as nice as I wanted it because of, uh, because I made the, the consistency very light i made the cement very very light so for this one which is going to be for my living room i'm coming in with uh like a thicker consistency i'm putting less water in uh in my cement yeah and getting my uh, definitely getting my inspor for my living room uh painting i'm going in with um I'm going in with the concrete onto my canvas. These canvases are first, like at first, they come painted, like they come painted with the white, yeah? Yeah, the, the guy, Bruster, paints them for you. So all you have to do is just get to work. So uh, just like I said, we're getting to work, darling. We are at work. This is extremely exhausting than I think out than i anticipated absolutely so i'm going in making uh, the designs that i think are nice honestly i don't know what i'm doing it is that trust the process kind of project baby this diy this diy is kicking my ass okay so we we're going in let's 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 just trust the process basically let's just trust the process but i love how it's actually coming along i love how it's coming along this is easier than um the one for the bedroom where the consistency was a bit watery so all you need is white cement this uh metal spatula then a container and water uh the paint comes in the paint comes in after um the paint comes in after the uh, the paintings have dried like the concrete has dried and everything <laughs>
want to sit back and relax and enjoy my evening. When all of a sudden, I hear this agitating, grating voice. This is the following day. <laughs> this is the following day. My paintings were dry. And falling apart. Everything was falling apart. Everything was falling off effortlessly. You didn't need to touch nothing. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what happened. I'm thinking maybe the guy I bought from the white cement gave me chalk instead. Or there is a primer that I had to use before. Or is there something that I had to mix in the mixture before? Um, oh, oh my god. No, all my hard work. Everything is falling up. Everything is falling up. I don't know what I did wrong. My paintings were so cute. But bestie, don't be like me. Probably it is the salmon. Probably it is. I, I, there's something I had to mix or something. <laughs> but my mama didn't raise no quitter. So stay tuned for part two. Because we're coming back. Because we gotta save my paintings, darling. We are saving my paintings. Because bestie, my mama didn't raise the loser. Okay, so we are coming up with backup plan. So stay tuned for part two because I'm definitely, definitely making another DIY for these specific paintings. Thank you for watching though. Thank you for coming this long with me. But what do you think is the problem? What do you think happened, bestie? Talk to me. What do you think happened, darling? In the comment section below, baby. What could I have done different? Oh, damn it. Love you, though. See you in part two.